So one thing that I feel like all kids are dealing with right now to some degree is bullying. And you know, I think it is great that we have become so focused on promoting kindness and teaching our kids that words can hurt. But honestly, I don't think that just teaching kids how to be kind is going to completely end bullying. Personally, I think we need to focus as much attention on teaching our kids how to handle bullies, specifically us as fathers, right? You know, we need to move away from this alpha male mentality of, man, you know what, if somebody's talking smack, man, just knock them out, you know, lay them down. I'm like, that doesn't solve anything. And I'll tell you what else it doesn't do. It doesn't teach our kids what real strength is all about. Now, we need to start raising heroes. And I'll tell you what I tell my boys, and I'm not saying that they listen to this all the time because they don't. But I tell my boys, I'm like, look, if somebody's picking on you, somebody's attacking you constantly, why don't you go over to them and reach out and try to help them and try to understand what's going on with them? Because look, there's gotta be something going on in somebody's mind if they constantly feel the need to attack you all the time. There's gotta be something bothering them, right? Who knows, maybe it's something that you did and you didn't even realize you did it. But if you can sit down with them and talk to them and try to understand each other, you might find out that you guys can get along and you might wind up being great friends because of it. Hell, I know some of my best friends in the world I battle with as kids, seriously. But you gotta, you gotta focus, you gotta act like a hero because what's a hero do? Seriously, a hero doesn't try to kill the bully or kill the villain. No, they try to reach out to him, they try to save him, right? It's like the end of every Batman movie. You know, when the Joker's falling off the building. What's Batman do? He doesn't let him fall. No, he extends his hand to the Joker and he tries to help him, right? And look, you guys wanna talk about, you know, being an alpha male? Well, let me tell you something. If you can reach out to somebody who's constantly attacking you all the time, and you could try to understand them and try to help them, that's real strength. That's real alpha shit. That's what heroes do. And look, you know, I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that I have all the answers because I don't. But I know this, if we constantly teach our kids to attack somebody every time they're attacked, the only thing that's gonna do is escalate the problem. And that's how wars are created. And we've got enough war in this world. We need to focus on how to create peace, straight up. And look, I know that this isn't easy to do because we have been hardwired as humans to think that if we don't attack somebody who's attacking us, that that's a sign of weakness. When really, that's the strongest thing you can do. But it takes a person with a lot of confidence, a lot of humility, and a lot of class to take that approach. Because that's an approach of love. And let me tell you something, love will always kill hate. And with that being said, I just wanna tell you guys that I love you. And as always, salute.